Bring forward, fall back. If the twice yearly hurdle of adjusting your body and clocks to daylight saving time and back fills you with dread, you're not alone. But it's more than just mental. Science shows it takes a physical toll. Heart attacks occur at a higher rate uh, during that Monday morning and also throughout that week. Blood pressure uh, goes up. There are also safety consequences such as car accidents, especially deadly car accidents, occur at a higher uh, rate. And there are the less serious but still noticeable consequences like fatigue and just generally feeling out of whack. So what do we do? Try eating dinner an hour earlier starting tonight or Saturday and going to bed early too, making sure to dim lights, including screens and get a good dose of bright light in the morning. The same tips apply to children and I think particularly to teenagers whose biological clock is already delayed. And so they are a population that will even suffer more from this moving this time forward in the spring. Multiple states have legislation in various stages to ditch the switch. But for now, only Arizona and Hawaii don't participate, meaning the rest of us will be turning the clocks ahead come Sunday. Sarah Dolliff, NBC News.